perfect, perfect. We got a self-love song and it's Whitney Houston. Let's go. So this is gonna be challenging for me because my inclination is to bring way too much weight up and try to like scream it. So I'm gonna again, I'm gonna approach this as if it's someone that is really going for the belt and maybe needs to narrow a little bit because that's usually what we see in Whitney Houston. If you don't know how to belt at all, go back, scroll through some videos and get some basic belting technique stuff. Um, I'll throw a little bit in here, but Whitney uses a lot of like open mouth belting, which just think if, if, if you have a hard time belting, go with wider vowels. If you already know how to belt and you're like pulling way too much weight and going flat, then we're going to talk about narrowing. Okay. Sorry, eating one. Mm. So right away, easy speaking. I believe the children are our future. She's talking. She's not like pressing on the notes. It's not weighty. Just an easy, easy sound. And and she continues to do that and stretch up. Show them all the beauty inside. Right? I, I, again, I'm not like, don't know this song super well. Inside. Right? So it's still light, but still mostly talking. Really just talking on pitch. Also, this music video is like wild. It's like all of these kids trying out for like a talent show. And they all have like different talents. or uh, Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, so as we get into the second verse, it's kind of the same. She's a little bit more, more cry to the sound. It's a little bit more full. Yeah, so she's just leaning into a little bit of a fuller tone. She, again, she's not pressing though. So here's where she's gonna go up high. Okay, so this is gonna be the point where most people have some issues, so. I decided, so for most female born people, that's just the bottom of the first passaggio. You're gonna wanna bring up a lot of weight, but I'm gonna dare you to kind of treat it like it's just kind of a whiny sound. So let's try it on a way, a little bratty, like hints of bratty. Way, 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 just to encourage with that vowel a little bit of thinness just enough that we aren't gonna go flat but we can still be connected to speaking voice so let's do that way 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 to anyone shadow anytime we do an unfinished sound we're gonna try to hold on to the feeling of that weird sound and try to put that on the lyrics all right okay so she's Whitney Houston, okay? So she's opening to I. She's using a really big I vowel. Not bad, especially if you have a harder time belting. Go to the full I. If you go, that I, that I, right? But for people that you fall into the trap of going flat and making it too thick, right? We're going to think, um, live is, <clears throat> excuse me, got a chip in my throat. So instead of thinking I, which is really back, I'm going to think more uh. Uh, which is a really neutral vowel that will help me have a thick sound but I can also narrow internally from there and not have it my tongue like get in the way as I believe adding just a little bit of cry as we go through that first passaggio okay I love an if vowel because it's gonna help you thin just enough right resist the urge to flip just practice on if vowels go Eee! try to have kind of an icky siren on that and then try the words or even try like oh we 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 like win we 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 that little bit of ickiness is going to help you stretch while still being powerful so let's put it on words they can't take away my dignity and you can see even i went a little flat there because i opened it a little bit or i didn't keep the stretch Let's try dignity. D's are hard for me because they stop my air so much. My D. Oh, no, not that. Ah! My dignity. Better. So I'm going to hold on. I would eat, like, I would need this coach for myself, right? So I would even use a little bit more bratty way. Wee, 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 my dignity. That was better. Okay. <laughs> ah, being vulnerable, showing you my tendencies. Oh. oh. So she's automatically coming up on top. Done. She's starting at a D on the, okay? So I want you to kind of think you're coming down over the top of the note. And let's try it crying like a baby. Let's try it way. Sorry, chips. Way, 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 way. Just like literally 
go, wah, 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 okay? So that feeling of coming down over it and staying bratty, let's try it with lyrics. Now, don't let the TH mess you up. Still think like you're saying way. The greatest love. Also, don't get caught up in that G. Oh, quickest way to go is on a G, right? Move through it. The greatest love. All right. Mm, let's keep going. Just look how effortless she's singing this as well. Oh, learn. Oh my God, she's just sliding. Okay, so she's taking an uh, uh, sound and she's treating it almost like a siren. Just go. Again, I'm gonna have a chip in my throat, but go. Learn, learn. She's keeping that elasticity, right, which is thinning her out just enough. Okay, we're gonna skip to where she starts to growl. And belt again, okay? <laughs> All right, so there's a trap here on anyone's shadow. If you have a hard time belting and you go light, then go to the full any, right? Go there, okay? If you pull, though, instead of going anyone, it's going to cause you to pull. It's going to cause your larynx to go up too high. It's not going to be good. So we're going to think in anyone's shadow okay just try it on the way again in anyone's shadow it's gonna help with your intonation i promise i promise i promise so here's where she starts to growl if if i fail oh my god i'm not <laughs> houston but basically to make that kind of growly sound we're gonna use a little bit of distortion, okay? And using uh, a version of like a higher version of false folds. So you're gonna, I want you to pretend like you're Kermit the Frog and then I want you to blow air through it. <laughs> That's the growl sound she's using on, if I fail, if I succeed, ha, ha, right? It's this ha, ha, kind of Christina Aguilera, ha, ha, right? So that <clears throat> upper distortion sound is going to be what causes that growl sensation. Do not try to like grab to cause it, right? It's isolate the distortion first, <laughs> and then mix it separately and then put them together and kind of just get all saucy with it. That's also not to say that you're also belting up to an F sharp. Mix belting, okay? So let's bring that baby sound back then. Way, way, right? And forget the distortion for a second. Just do if I fail, if I succeed. Way, 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 way. Really kind of bratty and kind of ugly, okay? Um, and it's on an I, right? The, the vowel that we go up there is on an I. So we're going to do way right into the words. Way, 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 if I fail, if I succeed. Right? We want it to kind of live in that similar place of the unfinished sound. Ah! So again, Whitney, big open ah. Right, so again, hard time belting, go the full ah, uh, but I kind of no matter who you are, I want you to think more uh than ah, uh, right? Ah uh will cause your tongue to kind of block your space. Thinking ah uh is better, and if you're going flat, even dare, hmm, what shadow vowel do I want you to use? Since I have a tendency to pull, I might be thinking in my brain, uh or eh, right? I just think of the next vowel over that's, more narrow that's gonna cause my intonation to pop up so it's like i'm still saying uh i'm just thinking in my brain that it's being put through an it or an it uh vowel um as i believe as i believe it just helps me not to like go flat ah another growl mine mine right so practice kermit separate from kind of this this crying call and then uh, uh, my dick <laughs> oh my god me doing distortion is honestly hilarious but though <laughs> i need to practice but that's kind of how you would put that together in a healthy way mm, don't let that l get messed up right it'll cause tension so flick that l out of your mouth as quick as you can okay so notice she didn't go lonely place. She went lonely place. So kind of cry on an A or even think E if you're going flat. Lonely place. Anyway, I'm running out of time. I hope that helped. Ah!